Let's walk through the steps of installing FlexNet Device Manager. Before we start, it's essential that you have ports 3333 and 8888 open in your firewall settings. Let's take a look. First, go to Control Panel, then Windows Firewall. Click on Advanced Settings, then Inbound Rules. Next, choose New Rule. Then Port, and hit Next. Next to specific ports, type in 3333, comma, space, 8888, then hit next. Make sure allow connection is checked and then hit next. Domain, private, and public should all be checked, then hit next. It's a good idea that you name this rule, something like FlexNet device ports, then hit finish. Now you want to create an outbound rule using all the same steps. Click on Outbound Rules, then choose New Rule, hit Port, then hit Next. Next to specific ports, type in 3333, comma, 8888, then hit Next. Make sure Allow Connection is checked, then hit Next. Domain Private and Public, choose Next. It's a good idea again to give it a name, and then hit Finish. To install FlexNet Device Manager, you'll want to find the installer inside the Installers folder in the Media Composer Installer package. You can get the Media Composer Installer from the Download Center in your My Avid account. For more information on that, check out the videos at avid.com forward slash how to. Once you have the Media Composer Installer package, double click on it to open. Then click Media Composer, then Installers. Finally, click on Volume License Server, and if you're doing this from a different machine, you can always stick the installer on an external storage device and bring it over to the server. Double click on the Volume License Server installer and follow all the default steps to install. Very easy.